Hello, welcome to RP Gamepire. I'm David. I'm Julie. And so now we're going to do the playthrough of Snowdonia, the deluxe master set. Oh. We did do a, an unboxing of this, so we're just going to be playing the first scenario. And there is a how to play video mm -hmm. and a review if you would like to click on those. All right, so let's take a look at the quick little overview here. Okay. So this is a worker placement construction game. We are having to remove rubble to build uh, a rail route up a mountain. So uh, you get victory points for building rail lines, so you remove the rubble, and then you can put an ownership marker to show that you own that, and then you'll see here on the card that it's worth two victory points. And so we'll be showing uh, throughout how you do that. And then you've got stations, you've got to remove the rubble uh, for the stations. And you can also develop that station and get ownership markers on that as well. So I'll show that real quick. So once uh, if someone removes this four rubble, they'll place their ownership marker on there and, and it's worth four victory points. Then someone has to remove the next one, next two, and you could place ownership markers on here, but you don't have to develop the whole thing in order to continue the route up the mountain, because you'll see that uh, there's other areas you got to uh, clear rubble and other stations. So there's stations all along the route and rubble that has to be removed and rail lines that need to be developed all the way to the end. So the game ends when the last <coughs> rail line is constructed or, geez, I forgot the other way it ends. <laughs> Are we ran out of something, wasn't it? Yeah, I'll look it up in just a second. We were out of markers. Yes, we're out of control markers. So you'll see here, thank you for remembering that, Julie. So there Welcome. are 16 control markers per player. We have two workers. Julie has 16 control markers. She's going to be the start player. Oh, nice. And two workers. And then uh, one thing you got to worry, oh, <laughs> you can get additional workers here in the pub. I don't know if I would want to hire people that hang out in the pub drinking all day, but whatever. <laughs> and then you have surveyors. They're just the, drinking soda. Yeah, right. Because <laughs> this takes place in the 1800s, I believe. Oh, yeah, no soda. So here's a surveyor, and you can move your surveyor up to different stations uh, along the mountain for points. So if your surveyor gets, for instance, to this position, it's worth one point. Here it's worth four. Here it's not worth as much. It's worth one here it's worth 11. You know, now that I think about it, we might not have played a rule right. This one's really? worth 15. I wonder if you count all the ones before it. It looks, I look at the arrow. Yeah. Well, that's the arrow that plays the card. So oh, we're gonna I have see. To, we're going to have to look up that rule. You know, this is the second time we're playing this. It makes right. me wonder if you get to count the points before the surveyor. Oh, that would be nice. Uh, that it's summative. Oh, yeah, that'd be kind of cool. I bet you it is. I bet so, you it is. Now that I'm thinking about it. All right, so... I know there's a big overview here because there's a lot of little moving parts. Uh, so that's for surveyors. You can move them. You can hire additional workers. And how do you do that? Well, they didn't have Caterpillar back then with uh, back <laughs> with backhoes. And I mean, they might have had something steam powered, but it's not like, right. like it is not now. Not like it is now. So you, there actually is an engine yard. So people think that this is like a, a ticket to ride type game. Well, no, it's a construction game. And so when you get steel, I'll show this. You can buy this engine, and this engine you can spend one Let's coal see. per turn to uh, hire additional worker. And it comes with two coal when you buy it. You can only have one engine per turn. So you you use engines. You can have one of these per uh, one of these. Sorry, you can only have one of these in your possession. You can get another one, but you'd have to trade out the other one. Okay. And so some of them cost two steel, one cost, you know, a couple of them cost one. And you use engines as the route is being built, there will be an engine following the route to do heavier work. Okay. So that's how they, that's what they would do. Ah. All right. So I've given you an overview of how you, you're building this route. You can get engines to get an extra worker. You can move your surveyor. Now, where are you going to place your workers? Well, you're going to, we have two workers to place each round. 
on this line right here. You can go on A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So we're going to place our workers first, and then we carry them out in order by how they're placed. So for instance, if someone puts their worker here on A, if they go on the position one, they'll get the, the choice of the first three resources, which I'll show where those are. They'll, if they go on position two, they will get the second choice of three resources and go first. Now, it's possible that someone could take both positions, positions and take, all, or take six resources. Or only one person goes there, and they just they get the three war resources and the first position, uh, right. the first player position for the next turn. So where do you get those resources? You get them here. I believe that's uh, what's that called again? Iron. Um, I know this is stone. Hmm. Uh, and sure. it'd be nice if they coal. Well, one's coal. What is it called here? Yeah, iron ore, stone, and coal. Mm. So iron ore, which you'll convert here into steel. To steel. Mm -hmm. uh, stone, which you'll use to build railway stations, which right. you could also convert rubble into stone. And then coal, which you'll use to, if you have get an engine, workers. to get extra workers. Right. So this is how you get resources. Here you'll place a worker here to remove a certain amount, amount of rubble. The amount of rubble that you re remove is equal to this track here. And this track will be uh, affected by the weather, which I'll explain here soon. And how many train uh, tracks you can build is also affected by the weather. Here is where you convert up to three times iron ore in the steel and or rubble in the stone. Here's where you lay track. This is where you can acquire an engine or develop a railway station. Here's where you get a contract, which I'll explain in a moment, and this is where you can move the surveyor. So let's take a look at the, the weather <clears throat> and the contracts. These are contracts. The first one, well, let me take off the picture in picture. These are the contracts. This one, uh, if no one acquires it, will go flipped over and these will slide down and the next one will come. We do know that the sun light, this determines the, the card on top of the draw pile will determine what the weather will be two days from now. And so you look at the contracts. The top part is how many victory points you'll get if you have five of your development markers on different stations, you get 15 points. And this means that you can use it on step D of the uh, resolve actions. And you have to say, I'm going to use it before you resolve the action. Then you turn the card like this to show that you use it. It's a one-time use item. So we'll go over these contracts when we acquire them. But it gives you additional abilities during that particular action phase. So what does the weather do? Well, the weather, right now, if we start at, you can remove two rubble and lay one track. Next turn it will be sunny. The sun will come, will be up two days from now. We know that fog is coming. So when it's sunlight, you can, you move the track up plus one rail and plus two rub, excavation for rubble. But when the fog comes, we won't be able to do those actions. The sun will move it up again or maximize, keep it where it's at. When it rains though, the rain, you'll see there's cards with rain, the rain will move it down, making it difficult for you to work. So the point is, weather is going to affect our ability to get uh, work done. Again, the whole point of this is to build the route, remove rubble, develop stations, and uh, develop the rail line, and the weather is going to affect our progress to be able to do that. And contracts are vital for acquiring victory points. Well, only the last thing to, to, to talk about is this line here. Every turn, depending on the number of players, you're going to draw new resources out of the bag randomly. And if you get white cubes, they go here. And it, this track basically allow, makes the game progress faster. It will develop uh, rail lines for you, even if you don't do it yourself. Uh, when you get the second white cube, you can buy engines. So right now we can't buy engines until we get a second event cube, a white cube. All right, so that was a big overview. If you watched the How to Play, I'll go that in more detail if I went too fast. 
but we have to have some context. And what was that rule that I was worried about? I oh yeah, that the surveyor. Yeah. If you get the points all before that, I'll look it up at some point here during the game. All right. All right. So you have the first rail. Yes, I do. You should take a look at the uh, the contracts because with the contract, if you look here, only one of us can go here. So this is an important thing you can do on your turn to try to get a card, and you can only get one card a turn, and it's I don't know, it's probably going to be about twenty turns. Mm -hmm. So the contracts are important for getting a, a lot of points. Okay, first thing I want to do is I'm going to put uh, someone. I want to go on. You want to get resources? Yes. A. Yes. You please. want you want to have the first three or? I'll do the first three, please. Okay. For me. Okay, I'm going to take a uh, contract action because I see a card that I want. It would be this one. Oh, yeah, sorry. It's this okay. One. That's a surveyor. That's a action. surveyor. Yeah, I pointed it to the wrong one before. And I would like to also... Because we don't have engines, we can't even get these uh, workers yet. Um, actually, I'm going to be greedy and I'm going to take all the resources. All right, you're going to take a lot of resources. Yes. All right, well, the excavation is only two cubes. There's two on the first one. See, I can't lay rail yet because I don't have steel. Right. Uh, and you're going to be getting the iron ore. So I'm, I'm basically two turns away from even being able to lay steel because I'm not yep. getting, getting any resources this turn. So, you know, I'll just move my uh, surveyor up. Okay. All right. So that was basically placing the two workers that we had. The turns go really fast. They do. All right. So now we go in order from A to G. So what uh, first you carry out your first one, what three do you want? I uh, definitely want one orange and two black. So she's taking all the coal. Yep. The reason why you want coal is because you can use it to activate your workers when you get an engine later. And then I'd like to take uh, two orange and one gray. Okay, one stone. One stone. Thank all you. All right. So Julie's done her two actions. So hers come off. So she's Thank put you. them over here under her, under her thing there. So eventually she's going to convert these three uh, iron ore into a steel bar. Right. Right. That way she can build rail lines. Yep. All right. So. I go all the way over to here. I'm going to take this contract card because I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to try to be rubble master. <laughs> and this says, well, first off, I want to build at least two rail lines. I need to get two, two steel bars and eventually take that action where I can build those, those rail lines. But it says here, whenever you take the excavation action this round, that's in part B, uh, remove double the number of rubble cubes. So I'm going to try to keep, keep this until I can get up to four rubble here. Yeah. So I want the weather to get so good that I can remove four rubble, and I'll be able to remove double that eight. So yeah, I'm going to keep, nice. I'm going to keep this card off to the side here. Okay. I haven't used it yet, so I haven't turned it sideways. Right. And then my other action is I'm moving my surveyor up to this station, so I know I'm going to get one point for sure. Okay, I take my guys off. Julie is still the first player. We, well, let me sh hang on. Let me take a oh, stop. Sorry. Because I didn't have the picture and picture off. All right, so this slides up to the discard pile. Okay, this slides over. The sun moves up here. We know it's pretty soon the fog is going to be coming. This comes down. This comes down. Oh, we know that rain is going to be coming about three days from now. So because this is the sun, we move this up plus one and two. So maybe I will use that card. We know t tomorrow, the next day, that these will be blocked. Right. Okay. So, that is the weather. So, did we do that in order? I believe we did. Well, I mean, we did the actions, but the order was <laughs> restock contract cards. Yes. yes. We checked weather. We have to do the Oh, restock pieces. the stockyard. So, once Six you draw... pieces. You draw the pieces. All right. Ooh, let's see what we get here. Yeah, we're trying to be careful because we've only played this. Three, this four, is our second five, time. Six. All right, so no white event cubes came up. Nope. But Julie is the first player still. And I'm going to go on C, please. Okay, so you want to convert your resources. Correct. Now I need to make sure I get resources. Yes, you do. I'm going to go into the second position so I can go first next turn. Okay. And, I'm and, the, gonna, and the reason why I'm going to do that is because there's no coal here. 
there's going to be plenty of resources left. I don't need to do do that action first. Right. I'm going to go get more resources, though. Okay. You'll get to pick first, but like yes. I said, there's it plenty of yeah. variety. Yeah. And then for me, I'm going to excavate. Okay. Well, I'm first because I'm in the eight one. What uh, I would like two orange and one coal plate, or one stone. Stone. Okay. Thank you. Me, I'm taking three iron ore. Okay. All right. And then I'm excavating. All righty. Now, I'm going to double. The excavation rate is four. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play my card. Okay. I turn it. That means I can do the double amount. I can do I can do eight. Nice. So here I remove two, five. Oh bummer. <laughs> eight. That's a bummer. Yeah, that is. Because if I were to remove this last one here, I would have gotten to put my control marker there. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure I excavate first next time. Right. Oh, I can't. The fog's you can't. coming. All right. Well, anyway, I got rubble. <laughs> Again, what are you going to do with rubble? So if you see here, I got a bunch of rubble. There are contract cards. See, like this one, it. honey, right here. No, it's not the same thing. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. The shovel kind of confused me. So this contract card, if I keep 16 rubble, I'll get 21 points. Right. But the trade-off is... <clears throat> you got to use rubble to get stone and you need stone to develop to get your control markers right. on rail station so that's the tension is how much rubble are you going to remove and are you going to spend the rubble to get stone right or are you going to keep it on your contracts to get uh exactly right anyway okay i'm going to turn in my three iron ore right okay and you can do it three up to three times. Well, I only have two. Well, you didn't pick the right stuff. Well, Are you I sure know. you don't want to pick another iron ore? Sure. Why don't we do that? Okay, so we'll go back in time. Okay, we went back in time. Woo okay, so what you do with the stuff that you get, I mean, that you spend, you put it back in the bag. Now, why is this important? Wait, wait. Hang that on. gray doesn't go back in there, honey. It does. Oh, yeah, you're right. You give me, you're supposed to give me six. I apologize. All right, so, so the six iron ore that she spent goes back in the bag. Now, why is this important? Because anytime you need to draw out of the bag, uh, for instance, when you're converting rubble to stone and there's no stone in here, because everybody has too much out on here, mm -hmm. you don't get it. So it's important to try to keep in mind uh, when you're draw when you're trying to get resources out of here if there's actually enough in there. Right. All right. So you get your two iron bars. I do. Oh, I'm sorry. Your steel. My two steel. So what can Julie use these for? She can build. Uh, right now it's at two. She can build two. She could build these two uh, railways here and put her control markers on there. If next turn she takes the rail action, unfortunately, the fog is going to be there and right, she won't so be able to take it. Right, I couldn't do it anyway. So I can save it. Yeah, so she's going to save it. So let's show where you put it. All right, and I'm going to give you this train back because it's the first. Well, not yet. Oh, all right. Okay, so let's go to again what we do next. Nobody got a contract card. Nope. So this first one goes here. Right. You slide over. Rain's going to be happening again. Hang on. Oh, okay. I just want to make sure I don't mess up. Oh, all right. I'm sorry. I mean, the sun you. comes off. Fog is happening now. Sun will happen the next day, and rain's going to happen again. Yep. Oh, not again. It's going to happen it's for the happen. first time. Right. So unfortunately, with fog, we can't remove rubble or build railways. No. And now we're going to pick six out of the bag. Yep. You do it this time. So or take turns. So you pass the uh, go ahead and pass the train marker. I will be happy to. There you go. Okay, there is a coal. Now the reason why I wanted to go first, oh, we take our workers off. Thank you. Yeah, your your guy. You know, it is a time of socialism, so maybe your guys are pinko communists. Oh. Yeah, maybe. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm making a, a, I, you're a making, social studies joke. Yeah, that's not funny. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it was communist back then. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, actually, they weren't called communists yet. Well, let's just keep going with it. Yeah, game. yeah, yeah. All right. So, knowing that can't build yet. Stop. Don't do that, please. It distracts me when you do that. When you're, I'm going to keep going first. Your turn. I'd like to be 1A, please. Okay, so you're going to draw resources as well. Yep. I want to also build resources. 
and, and convert resources. I am going to go where the survey goes. So you're going to move your survey around. Yes. All right, so you get to pick what resources you want first. What I want? would like uh, two iron ore and one coal, please. Okay. Thank you. I'm taking three iron ore. See, now this is where Julie could have messed me up. Uh, there was only four iron ore there. By her not taking more, that gave me three to use. So now, when I go to this action to convert, I have enough here to convert into two iron bars. And I wanted to make sure I stayed first so that I can lay these two tracks here and beat you to it. Okay, so that's where you got to think ahead. Because uh, you, if you would have uh, taken the first position, you already had those two. Our, uh, steel bars and you could have built it before me so again that's the race element of this game all right so now you're going to move your surveyor up mm -hmm. all right so the turns over yep the fog has been lifted it's going to be now it's sunny so it goes up plus one uh, lay track plus two excavation so it's maxed out but we know it's going to go down the following turn because it's going to rain the next day. Mm -hmm. This contract goes away. We move our workers, and I stayed the first player. Can you each move mine, please? Yes. Thank you. All right, so I know that I want to develop these two rail lines, and plus I have a card here that if I get two rail lines built, I'm going to get 15 points at the end of the game, so I definitely want to do that. So I'm going to go to this spot here first. Okay, you're next. Okay, I'm gonna go to this one. You're gonna get another contract, okay? Well, my first contract. Oh, hey, we forgot to pull. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this can affect things. Yep. Because if I drew a bunch, now what could have happened? If I drew three event cubes, we would have uh, developed these two right. rail lines I couldn't have touched automatically, them. and yep. then I would have changed what I was gonna do. <laughs> All right, so God, we have a lot of stone that we haven't bought. I know. But we did develop one. Oh. Uh, so you may want to take your turn back because we, we excavate four. These are excavated. Right. Which means now that no one but can, was able to claim those. That's because, true. So if somebody were to take the excava excavation action, they would have gotten those six victory Sure, points. I'll do that first. No, just stop. You don't let me finish. Oh, I'm sorry. Because you, I was saying you missed the opportunity to do it. Oh, yeah. Okay. So the game removed the rubble, freeing up stuff. Julie cannot take these or, or I, but she could spend stone. She would have to spend four stone to, to uh, claim this and get nine victory points. So this rubble is removed from the game. It's not even used. So if you really want... No, I'm to, still going to go where I was. Yeah. That's why I wanted to point that out, that it's not a good move. Right. Excavating would have been a good move if, but we couldn't do it last turn because of the, right. because of the uh, fog. Right. And because the event came up, it excavated it for us automatically. All right. So you're going to go to... The card. The F. card. Yep. Where am I going to go? I'll excavate. Where do you want to go? I want to go to 2A. I want to be the first player. Okay. All right, what three resources do you want? I would like... Uh, I would like um, one iron ore and two stone. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. And then I excavate here at the rate of four. So... I have more rubble, and then uh, I'm going to convert into, oh. Yeah, you're right. I did this wrong. I was supposed to go here, honey. Oh, that's yeah. fine. I, I was, I don't even have any iron ore. Oh, okay. yeah, no worries. So I wanted to lay track. You knew I wanted to do that. All right, so I, you have to go in order on laying track, unless the event comes up where the game lays a track for you. Right. So I turn it over. That's for two victory points. I turn this one over. This is worth three victory points at the end of the game. And now I have enough uh, tracks I've laid to get this 15 points. So nice. that's why I did that. 
Now that does become, so this goes back in the supply. So I've excavated mm -hmm. and I've laid my track. Right. And then you get to pick a contract card. I'm picking this one right here. Okay, let me show it on camera. Sure. So Julie's picking this one here. If she has six rubble and laid one track, by the way, if you have multiple cards with rubble and track on it, you cannot duplicate it. Right. So if she had another card like mine, she'd have to have laid three tracks to claim both these cards. All right, but anyway, this would be worth 18 victory points. But the reason why she wants this is that after this card has been activated, no other contract card may be activated for the rest of the round. Interesting. So that goes in your area. Yep. So I'll go ahead and, yeah. All right. And then you picked a contract? I did. That's it. The turns go so fast. All right. So we slide this over. The first position has been taken, so mm -hmm. nothing gets discarded. The sun is going to go here. This flips up. Sun comes off. Now it's raining. When it's raining, things go back one each because it's harder to get work done when it's raining. Right. And then we, you can pick out of the bag this oh, time. Okay. Can we take our people off the board? Oh. And I'm first player, by the way. Oh, yeah. Okay, no white event. No white Cheers. event. All right, okay. you know what? Uh, you go ahead and pick first. I'm going to look right. up that excavation scoring. I am actually going to lay track. Before I forget. Before David does. And then when you're ready, hon, it's your turn to put your guy down. Yeah, it actually says score a number of victory points as indicated in the top right corner mm -hmm. of the station card reached by your surveyor. Oh. So it does not include the cards previously. Okay. So you would get 21 points there. If you got all if the way. If you got that far. If you got this way, it's 21. But here's the interesting thing. Right. The reason why I question that is because this card is only worth one. Oh, interesting. So this one's worth one and four. So I guess if you get up here, it's going to force you to want to move up to the next one to get 11. Do, you, or do these come out randomly or do they specifically go in these spots? Do you remember when you laid out your cards? It, they go out in a specific spot, I if see. I remember. I let, me, see. let me look at the setup again. Okay. Uh, well, I did it like the... Uh, the picture? The picture show. I see. Railway route track cards, three. No, it's two stations. Mm -hmm. And order them by the number in the top right corner of the card. Ah. Yeah, right here. That one says seven on the corner. Yeah, that one so, says six. And there's certain ones I had to remove for a two-player game. So oh. it's interesting that they, it's actually, you basically have to do survey or action twice to get the better action, to get the more points. Right. So it is what it is. Okay. I, um, I'm not too sure why they do that because maybe it's at the a point in the mountain where it's easier to get to. I don't know. Oh, I don't. Yeah, who knows? All right. It's your turn, honey, whenever you take your breath. I have a bunch of rubble. You do have a lot of rubble. You could turn it maybe on. Maybe I'm a rock and roll ru rebel. <laughs> I'm going to go first next turn. Okay, I will let you do that. I am laying track. Um, hmm. I think... You got two of those for now. You, you know, know it's Rock and Roll Rebel and there's a crazy train. That's true. But you don't know now because I uh, tears, uh, there's no more tears. Okay, I have a question. Yes. No more Aussie stuff. Okay. If I take this one right here, did you say I can combine that with well, my card that I have? Let's show the, uh, okay. the audience what you're talking All about. All right. So Julie's is thinking of acquiring this card. Correct. It's a really nice card for 20 four points, but she has to lay right. three tracks. Which would be easy. But she better lay four tracks if she wants to get this card as well. So okay, you're, if you get I'm that card, you're committing to four tracks. Okay, I'm going to do it. Or. Nope, I'm doing it. Or, okay, so you're, you're acquiring this one? I am oh, you're going to acquire that. I'm yes. going to. It's not my Your turn guy's yet. guy's laying down on the job. I know. Well, they have T-Rex arms putting him down there, so they, they have no choice but to fall down. I'm going to excavate. Okay. Because I want to be able to get that place uh, uh, an ownership marker. All right, Dal, well, you're first. All right, so I'm going to take three or okay. and I go next. I get to remove three. to this. 
three rubble. Mm -hmm. Now you don't get to use your other card anymore to get double. No, I've double. already used it once. Right. So I removed three, and because okay. I cleared that station, that's worth three points for me. So I nice. put it there on the on the station. Okay. And I'm done. All right. Well, I am going to lay the on uh, that first track there, and I get to lay two tracks. Yes, because so I'm going to do the next according two. According to here, the, mm -hmm. the track rate, even though it's raining, you still right. get to do two. So these get flipped over. And I'm using my You're two. Using your two. Yes, sir. Uh, steel. <clears throat> so, get, so Julie got five victory points for that as well. You put them on that one right there, huh? And then the last thing I'm going to do is and I am going to take that card that you had shown. So you're taking that card. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to put so it with my other one. So you're adding it to your cards. Yep. In fact, well, I'm going to no, put it next to each other. Like that. Now yeah. what's your ability that you get with another card? I oh. may discard this card yeah. instead of a steel bar when required to pay for train maintenance. So at some point, an event comes up here. If you get another, enough white cubes, mm -hmm. that makes the train maintenance comes up. So if you own an engine, one of these engines off to the side here, which we still can't buy it because we didn't get a second event cube. Right. You know, if you don't have a steel bar, you're going to have to give up that engine. Right. All right, so we're in with the round. we got we rain, rain coming, up. coming up. Rain goes away this turn. Oh, the sun came back out. Yay, so it means we get to move up. We move up. And I'm going to get the... Oh, is it my turn to draw? Yeah, you know, go ahead and draw again. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm first, by the way. Yes, you are. And you need the little first player. Thank you for taking my, my little workers off. One, two, three. Three, four, five, six. Oh, okay, right. Event. Now we can buy engines. Nice. But you need steel to buy en engines. Yes, we do. And I don't have any <laughs> steel right now. Let me look at the events. Sure. Uh, the contracts. I'm sorry, the contracts. Do okay. Want those? <laughs> All right, I'm going to go here. Oh, righty. I am actually going to take off the rubble off that one, so I'm going to go to number B1, please. You can please. be the first excavator. Yes, thank you. And then I'm going to get resources. I want to stay a second. Well, actually, I'm going to be the... Wow. I'm going to need coal eventually. Julie's got a ton of coal, so I don't think mm -hmm. she's going to take the coal. If you really want to hold on to that much coal, that's up to you. No, but what I am going to do is... Um, See, I'm betting that you don't want that much coal because you have three already. Yeah, you know what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to... You can buy an engine. See, you have, no, you don't have any steel bars. You don't have, you can't buy an engine yet. No, but I have four of these and I can go on there. Yeah, if you want to develop this one, you can get nine victory points. Okay, that's, that's what I'd like to do. Yes, yeah, so you go to the build. Yes. So this spot, she can either build, you know, get an engine or, or uh, build on a uh, station. Yep. All right, so you're first. I'm first. Yep. I'm taking a iron ore. Okay. I'm next. Can you reach those for me, please? I get four of them taken off. Yeah, according to the rate. Right. So now this can be the track can be laid there. Yep. Thank you. You know what I forgot to do when I did those two iron. What's that, hun? Bars. I forgot that I could have developed my rubble, but I, oh, I forgot. Oh darn. That's all right. So here, I'm going to develop. Uh, let me show. You going to do your rubble, or are you going to do your? Orange. Well, I get to I get to do it three times. That's correct. So I get two steel bars. Yep. Okay. Convert for that. Mm -hmm. And then two. every two rubble can turn into a stone. I got to take it out of the bag. So oh, that's right. This is where if you weren't, and you get to look in it. Okay. But if there wasn't any stone there, I wouldn't get that action. Oh, that's right. All right. So these go back in the bag. Okay. Here you go. These go out of the game. Okay. And now I have my two steel bars. And then. All right. I'm the last player to do something, so I'm going to take my yeah. stuff and right, put it in the bag. bag. Give me and an ownership marker. You got it. Now, you can move ahead <clears throat> to any station where the rubble has been removed. So Julie could build here or here. I want the one with the most. But not here yet. Right. So the best one for you, how much stone do you have? You only had four, I right? gave you four. So this is the best spot. That's worth nine victory points. Right. All right. So. Okay. This. Okay, so it's now going to go away because we didn't. No one. We have it. rain coming again. Right, and I'll flip because, that. Because remember, oh. you look at the top card there for what the next weather is going to be. Right. Sun goes away. It's still sunny. We're maxed out already. We know we're going to get two days of rain. It's going to drop down. Yeah. And Julie's drawing the cubes. Oh, those oh. are yours, honey. 
I'm still first player. We're not drawing events. There we oh. go. You just said that and look what happened. Okay, so just let me make sure. Okay. I'm pretty sure <coughs> that when the event comes up for the lay track, it's equal mm -hmm. to the current track rate. Oh, okay. But they want to make sure. Sure, that's a good thing. Dun, 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 dun. Lay track. Equal to the current lay track rate. Okay, so we can do four times. Well, right? The, yeah, in fact, the rubble, does the rubble get removed too? Or is it only ones that have been unrubbled? Uh, that's a good question. Yeah, it, it actually ignores the rubble too. Oh. So, wow, it's going to be two. Mm -hmm. So, this one gets developed. We can't own it now because the game did it for us. Okay. And this one, the, rub the rubble is removed and the track is created. So the reason why we have these mm -hmm. events is so that the game progresses and gets finished. So sooner. we can build on the second one you uh, no, did? The no, we cannot build on these. Okay. The game built it for us. Gotcha. But we can remove the rubble from the station still. Okay. All right. Okay. So knowing that, that those ownership markers are coming up. Right. And knowing that the rain's going to make it hard to do it, I'm taking the, the first excavation action. So that way I can put both of my ownership markers on there. Oh, we didn't place these. You didn't place them. I did my job. You didn't do your job. Um, By the way, when the fourth white cube comes up, we recycle. Right. And this event will close off a station. We can't build on it anymore. I think... I am going to, I'm going to do this. You're going to convert resources? Yes. Yep. You're going to get stone, I guess? No, maybe. Uh, yeah. You know well, what I'm going to do? You have no clue what I'm going to do, buddy. I'm going to get an engine. Okay, well, you do that. I am. You just do that. That and way I can have a third worker. If I get some coal. I don't have any coal yet, though. Oh, wait, I, I, I went to the wrong spot. It goes there. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to go there too. Okay. Oh my God. Well, you know he's there, people. He's always sleeping on the job. That's, that's because he's a socialist. Oh, dear God. You, Will you just go. <laughs> <sighs> I see. Uh, all right. So, excavate. Excavate at the four. Mm -hmm. Oh, I remove this four rubble. Yep. Add it to my rubble, and I place my ownership cubes on there. That got, got me, earned me five victory points doing that move. Yeah, you're a teacher? Got you, huh? Yeah. Well, you know what? That's my vernacular. So you're making fun of my culture. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I'm turning in my... You're not respecting my culture. I'm going to put it in the bag, and you just be quiet. Okay, so you, you, you converted three iron ore I to did. a steel bar. To a steel bar. And you still have two more conversions. You want to convert four rubble to two stone? Uh, yes, I think I would like to do that. Okay. And so you got to take the stone out of the bag. Then. Actually, no. No, no, no. I want to keep it. You're so going to keep it? Yeah, because I need it for this. But you just took a stone. You just took that action. You can always get more rubble later. Oh, uh, that's true. Okay, why not? I mean, if it was towards the end of the game, I would say like, yeah. Yeah, that no, sense. that's a good point. Okay. Right. And then you go next again. All right. So I have one steel bar. Yep. I can get two steel bars. I'm going to do this engine over here. Okay. I turn in two. Gives me a coal. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you why I took it. Okay. Be because I like to excavate. Yes, you do. So it gave me a coal. So at least I can get an extra worker next turn. Right. But it gives me plus two excavation for rubble. Mm. So this goes here as part of my my uh, player area. Okay. And I'm going to slide these up. All right. And then I get, uh, I'm the next person to do something. I'm going to take my steel bar. Hey. And I'm taking the steel bar, putting okay. it there, and I'm going to go on there with the number seven. See how it says one, it's worth seven points. What are you talking about? Oh, what? yeah. So that's what I'm doing. All right, so let me show that. I'm going, what are you doing? I don't understand. That's because <laughs> we haven't done this action too often. All right, that makes sense. I know so Julie does. decided to, to turn in a steel bar to claim that part of the station for seven victory points. So her ownership marker goes on there. Yep. Not bad, huh? 
Oh, that's, that's a good idea. I know it but is. But you could have gotten an engine, but that's the choice you made. That is the choice I made. Yeah, you made a learning choice. I did make a learning choice. Stop All it. right, so this goes away. Our next thing is rain. Oh, we're going to have three days of rain. That's going to just be really poopy. All right, so the sun is goes away. It went away forever. No. It's the end of the world. And it goes down one. Okay, so the rain makes it go down one in each category. Yep, in fact, it's going to go did. down two more times. Oh, my gosh. It's going to be really bad that developmentally. Gonna be bad. But hey, at least the sun's going to come out. The sun will come out day. tomorrow. Sorry, I don't sing. That, I shouldn't have done that. I apologize. You're fine. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to draw from the bag. Mm -hmm. Six cubes. We'll take our workers off. I'm still first player. Oh, she's super special. I am super special. Can you reach me my people, please? Your people? My people. My little pink people. All right. Thank you. Now, knowing that the sun is coming out. Tomorrow. And two tomorrows. <sighs> this is probably going to be the last turn you can really excavate well. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use my worker. Okay. I'm turning in a coal. Oh, it goes in the bag. Oh, right. Okay. So he comes from the pub and he comes stumbling in. He's drunk. <laughs> so, but that's okay. Oh, you still use him as a worker. Maybe he ate some food to yeah. absorb the alcohol. Well, they, it is in Wales, supposedly, so it might have been eating a lot of potatoes to, there absorb, you go. The, to absorb the alcohol. Potato bread, maybe? All right, so I'm going to excavate <laughs> first. Okay. I'm only going to get five, though. Wow, that's a bummer. Well, you know what? Quit whining and just get your stuff. Goodness. You know what? I'm going to take a contract. Okay. Go. Uh, I would like to be first player, please. I can be that way. I am going to be that way. And I'm going to be the first one to draw resources. Good, you be that way. And then I... Hmm. I would like to excavate. Okay, I'll excavate next. Okay. Maybe I'll get luck uh, because you got, you didn't count ahead like I did. The reason mm -hmm. why I didn't excavate because I can only remove five, so no one's going to get the station. But now that you've done it, I can get that station. Mm. Oh well. So you got to count ahead. Well, I didn't, obviously. All right. Okay. So now we go in order. I get to pick first. Three coal. Three orange, please. That way I can keep on getting a, an extra player. Every All time. right. Excavate. You get to take three unless you have a card that helps you. Uh, no, you don't. Nope, I don't. Get rubble. Thank you. This good flips over to be developed. I excavate now, and because of my train, doo -doo, I get to do plus two, and so I get to do five, three. This is why I decided to do it after Julie, it's because now I can get the. Uh, even though Julie started it, I took the reward of placing my ownership marker on that station. Now the contract that I'm going to go for, let me take off the picture in picture. I'm going to do this one so I can get steel bars quicker. Okay. But this is so inviting. No, I'm going to take this one because it's worth 24. Alrighty. So I put it here. I know I don't have as much room here, but I haven't used it yet. So hopefully I can lay three more tracks. So here we are back to, again, the turns go so fast. All right, this flips over. Sun. Sun is going to come out in two days from now. So unfortunately, it's raining. We can only do two and one, two rubble removal and one lay track. Oh, I see a card I may want. So he's getting more resources. I go stumbles back into the pub. Julie gets the first player marker. You're going to draw an event cube? <gasps> she did. All right, so this is how this works. We haven't had this come up yet. This goes here. This station gets closed off for development. So Julie was able to get one of her ownership cubes there. No one else can develop there, but we can still develop this one. So this is closed off. These other three white cubes now go back in the bag and recycle back in there to help lay out, lay out that. If for some reason we ever get to the 10th position here, you just keep on cycling back into here. All right, so you are first player, Julie. Uh, 1B, please. 1B. 
Ah, you no, I'm sorry, one A. B, B2. That's what I meant. No, A2. I okay. want to be first player. <laughs> so, okay. All right, I'm going to spin the coal to get another worker. <laughs> Again, maybe you sh I should be hiring you the way you're talking. <laughs> and I've only had coffee. <laughs> All right, so I got another worker. And I want to get oh a contract card. Goodness. The reason why I want a contract card is because this card has come up. And if I keep eight rubble, I'll get 11 points. And I have not been converting my rubble into, po into stone. So that's I want to get those contract cards. Okay. And then I would like to... Why don't you convert? Just... Because you need steel. I know, but I already have a plan of what I want to do. So sh okay. Please. Sure thing, Julie. I'm gonna go here. You gonna get it? What are you gonna do? To build on a station? Yep. Okay, I'm just curious. I want to check with you. But again, it's the second time we've played. I want to get resources. Okay. Okay. What do you? Oh, I get to go again. And then I want to convert. Might as well convert. All right, so the three resources I get, I'm getting three iron ore. What are you going to get? I would like... Uh, two, three, I'm going to take three of these. Three you stone. Three stone? Mm -hmm. All right, I'm converting. So go to my camera and do three conversions. Three uh, iron ore into a steel bar. And I'm going to convert my rubble twice into two stone. I gotta take it out of the bag. Hopefully there's some in there. Yes, there is. Okay. The iron ore goes back in the bag. The rubble goes away off the, out of the game. And so I have some stone to build to construct a station next turn if I want to. Is that what you're gonna do? Yep, put that in the you bag. You have four. Uh-huh, and it's going right there. And that's worth how many points? Nine. Yeah, that's a good play. I know it is. You beat me to it. I know I did. All right, and then me, I'm going to get a contract card. Yeah, you're going to take that good one. Hey, what is this here? I don't know. Is it? Did we forget to place it? Yeah, we forgot to place it last turn. Okay. Because remember, I, I, I drew the event. Correct. Okay. So I want this card so I can get the points for having rubble. Okay. And this says here... Uh, I took this contract after all other lay track actions have been resolved. You may take an additional lay track action. So if I have a bunch of steel, I can lay track twice according to the current rate. So let me move this stuff over a little bit here so I can show my cards. You know, when you're sitting at the table, how does that gambler song go again? I know when, no to when to fold them. them, fold them. Know when to hold them. When yeah. when to fold I'm not them. much of a country guy. I do like some country music. Although I almost did get into that movie, you know. I was almost in that movie. Uh, the Cloudy. Because we used to live in Tucson. And old to old Tucson Studios. Oh, the fog's coming. Yep. Tucson Studios was there. Old, old Tucson. Tucson. Old Tucson. It's still there. And I was an extra in, in movies and stuff back then. All right. So, minus one each. It's still there. Yeah, I know. They don't do as much production there No, anymore. they don't. No. That's because of the fire. Yep, there was a really bad fire there many, many, many years ago. It was horrible. Yep. But, you know, it's cool to see that they have an actual working train. Yeah. That you get to ride on. Yeah, if you can put those where they All belong, right, so. please. Oh, and then you can take off our, our little workers. Our you're little still worker first, bees. You're still first player. I know. He goes back to the pub to get drunk some more. Okay. Um, I'm going to convert. Ooh, he stood on his head. <laughs> All right. And then I'm going to hire my worker, another worker again. You okay. need to get an engine. I keep on... Well, just... I'm just saying. I got, I got an idea of what I want to do here. Just saying. Well, where are you going to do that? You know what? I better... Right. It's that one, that first one. Did anybody build on this Not one? Not yet. Oh, well, then it stays like this. I, I flipped it over by mistake. Ah. Oh. Okay. That's why I thought the game developed it. I haven't picked yet. So oh, sorry. Well, I know where I'm going to go. You're going to take it from me. 
come on in. Hang on. Okay, okay bye. bye. I love you. Love you guys. Have a good day. Okay, we're, our son's going to work. All right, so. You saw him on camera if you watched uh, Seven Wonders. And All throw, right, throw burrito. so. Where am I going, Julie? Help I don't me out. Know. No, I'm not helping you. I'm, I'm going here. Doing my own I'm thing. I'm getting resources. You're going to build a track, aren't you? Yep. Fine, I don't care. I'm, <laughs> I'm getting more resources. Okay, my resources. Oh, wait, I forgot to take my guy here. I did spend it. And then oh. now I get to... I'm going to get another uh, contract again. Okay. Because that's my only way to keep up with you on stations. All right. All right. Hey, guess what I'm getting? I don't know. Six of those? Yeah. I need it. And I'm using my three to put it in and get a steel bar, but I'm going to leave the steel bar there because I'm also going to build on which third? Yeah, that the one. third one here. No, I thought I could build. No, oh, you're right. Someone you're right. has not flipped over. You're right. So you got two victory points for that. Yep. Okay. And I did mine. The contract I'm taking, which you can't see on camera, but I'm going to show you now. Oh, okay. Again, I have a lot of unspent rubble. Yeah, you do. So that's going to be 11 victory points. And then... Whenever you take the stockyard action this round, you may take two additional cubes. So I, I have that for later. So I'm going to move my stuff over. Show that these cards I haven't spent yet. Now, I am the first player. Yes, you are. But I oh. have this card to steal it from you Train. on a different turn, which I may do later. Yeah, uh, because you're a meanie. All right, so let me take off the picture in picture. All right. This card goes away. That card's so the sun. sun's going to be coming out. All right, hey, the sun came out. Yay. It moves up. Two for the shovel and one for the train All track. All right, so at least it can lay three. Right. Oh, I need to do this. Can Which you take the people off, please? Makes me think, what am I going to do? You're going to get another guy, I'm sure. I don't know. Oh, look at that, honey. All right, that's going to change things. Yep. Okay, excavation rate. Uh, did we do this in the right order? Um, Hang on. Restock contract cards. We did do that. Check weather. We Restock did the yard. So it is based on the current rate. Yeah, so we did it right. So the reason why, the reason why I was checking that is because you got to go in order because the, the excavation rate changed, mm. and because this event, uh, you remove rubble equal to the current rate. That's why I want to make sure I did it in the right I order. I see. Okay, okay. So that's now available to be. Built on? Uh, built. Okay. All right, so this sucks. That sucks for you, not for me. Because now, because I have an engine, that event, I have to spend a, I'll put it right here in front of my face, <laughs> I have to spend a steel bar to keep my engine, which I was going to use to build a rail line. So, yeah, I'm uh, going to spend it. Sucks for you. It because it cost me two to get it, so I lost it. Bummer. Sorry. Not. Yeah, that's okay. No. <laughs> Done that with stock. Yep. And you get to lay your little dudes down. So now I'm going to use my last coal. I better get more coal if I want to get, get yeah. an extra action. And by the way, where does, it say to, where does it say to do that again? It's right here on your engine card. Spin a coal to get an extra worker. Mm -hmm. Now, if you had more than one of No, those you can only have one engine at a time. Oh, okay. Remember? That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's Sorry, a, that's I forgot. A, no, that's good. It's an important rule to remember. All right, so I did get my extra guy. He keeps on saying, leave me alone, I'm drinking. <laughs> yeah, but if you don't work for me... You're saving his liver. Just think of that. You're that's, saving it his says liver. If, it, if you don't work for me, you're not going to have money to get more drinks. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, so... You're saving his liver, dear. Yes. <laughs> I have to convert to get more steel bars, so I'm taking that action first. I would like to go on a 2A. So you can be the first player? Yeah. Okay. To probably steal from me anyway. I'm going to get more resources and go there. Okay, and then I would like to... Um, wow, if I did that, then I'd have to have... I'd have to have four... I'd have to have nine of those. That's going to be too many. Um, You know what? I think I'm going to move my excavate. No. I'm going to go for a card. Can okay, you go for a card? Yeah. Excavation rate is two. Well, it's three. 
I have three stone. Might as well do it now, because I don't think I'll get around to it. Right. I'm going to build. All right, so I'm taking three iron ore. What are you taking? Same thing, please. Thank you. There's no coal, so I won't be able to get, use another worker Thank next you. turn. All right, I get to do it three times, converting all nine of my nice. iron ore into steel bars. There you go. So I get three. You will be the first player, but I'm spinning my card to prevent you from doing it. Oh, he's So toad. I'm going to stay the first player. Gosh, you are Too so bad. not nice. Too bad, so sad. Whatever. Okay. Whatever. And then I, I'm going to spin my three stone. I can't build on this station. I can build on this one and get seven points, which I will. Okay. And I'm going to take this card here. Okay. You want to oh, show them what it is? Shona, uh, yeah. Julie's taking this one. I think that's a good one. This contract. She already has the two stations. Yep. I don't know if you have enough rail routes throughout, but you can decide which card you exactly. want to do. Exactly. Okay, swap the weather disc in the middle position on the weather track with one of your choices from the general supply. Mm -hmm. So that happens during A turn. You can't use it now. Uh, I mean, I, I assume it's possible to acquire a contract that you can use on F or G. Oh, maybe. Okay, so you're, you're done. Yes, I am. All right, so take the picture and picture off. Okay. Slides down. Rain. Rain's coming. It's fog. Oh, that means we can you build don't anything, get to do anything. Which means I got the three steel bars and I can't do anything with it yet. Uh, but that's okay. That's okay. Because I have another option. Oh, well, look at you, Mr. Smarty Pants. Okay. I'm, I'm first player because I stopped you. Yeah, no. Wait, 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 so wait. you got to draw the six. Yes, I am. No coal. What the heck? I can't use my guy. No, you can't. Poor baby. Oh, he's going to get, well, I just get to drink him. <laughs> drink him. Now, I could do a build action <laughs> to do steel bars for the coal state, I mean, for the stations, but I want to save it for the rail lines. Let me see what I can do here. Hmm. I've already used those cards. Let me take this talk out. All right. Hmm. 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 I'm going to go here. All right. I want to get more. I'm going to convert. You're converting, huh? Yep. You're conversion master. I am. I can't excavate. I don't want any more. Wow, five. So this card came up. So if somebody does lays five tracks, they'll get 50 points. Interesting. That's a possibility to take that. Instead, I'm going to uh, let's get more resources. And you're getting a card. Yep, you're going for that card. All right. Darn right, I am. So I'm going to use my card. Whenever you take the stockyard action this round, you may take two additional cubes. I get eight. Oh, nice. Good for so you. So this round. It didn't say use once this round. Oh. Ah. Now, maybe somebody in the comments would tell me, you didn't play that right, which is fine. Let me know. Yeah, exactly. Please let us know if we're playing any of this incorrectly. Yeah. If you've played this more than we have, which this is only our second time. And I think we're doing a darn good job. And I think we've said that now more than twice. <laughs> Sorry. Right. So I'm taking three, <laughs> six. I, did, I get five. Right. And I want to take another five. Wait, what? You don't get ten. I get plus two each time, and I did the action twice. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm going to... Oh, let me take it off my screen. I'm going to turn in my three iron ore and get a okay, steel bar. You can bar. also convert if you want. No, I'm keeping them. Thank you. And then, and then, then I'm going to take this card. i show it again on your, on your screen. All right, I'm now look, you way. have things that you haven't even used. Do you want to use anything there on your... Um, let's see here. You can convert. Well, it's too late. You could have used a weather thing, but you can yeah. save it for another turn. I'll save it. So, oh, here, let me take out the picture in picture. I mean, you got to remember to use your cards. I know. I There's just a lot for me to remember, and it's kind of hard. So I'm doing the best I can here. 
Like the Queensryche song? That's right. You can. That's right. That's that you can. All right, so. You take care of those. If those sun is coming out later, the fog goes away. Yay. It's sun. It goes up one rail, two excavations, so it's maxed out on excavation. But the fog is going to come up again. Now, what's that card do for the weather? Let me see. Uh, swap the weather disk in the middle position on the weather track with one of my general choice with one of my choice from the general supply. You want to make it sun or you want to make it go down? I mean, it's up to you. I'm going to keep it where it is right now. Okay, you're not going to use it. Well, I mean, it's going to be raining next turn. Oh, well. So if you're going to use it. Yeah, let's use it now. All right, so you're going to swap it out for sun? Yes. Okay. Decisions, decisions. Oh, I know. Man. I'm taking the uh, convert resources action. Yeah, darn it, I knew you would do that, but I couldn't stop you. I know you can, because I'm a superstar. And I'm going to excavate. And I would like uh, two A. A. So you'll be able to go first. Yes. All right, so you're taking the yes. decision. What three resources do you want? Um, all of the orange one, please. Three. Yes. Okay. I mean, not all, but you knew what I meant. All right, I'm excavating. I get okay. four for nice. the day. Plus two for my engine, so I get six. Nice. I almost made it so that you were going to build another rail track, so <sighs> I almost messed up. You only have one steel bar. I basically would have helped Julie by removing all that rubble there and that opening up great. another. Yeah, I know. I would have been happy with that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now you get to convert, honey. Oh, yeah. Uh, let me go to my screen. Three. I can do this three times. I'm going to get three steel bars. Okay. And then put your goodies in the bag. In the goodie bag. In the goodie room. In the goodie room. In the goodie room. Welcome to the goodie room. Welcome to the goodie room. Okay. And I'm going to build. <laughs> <laughs> can you flip that five over for me, please, hon? That one right there. All right. So you only get to build one. Now, the rules say you have to, if you have that many steel bars, you have to build two. But you only have one steel I only bar. I had one. I'm going to pay for it right now. So Julie has one, two, three, four. Can you make that card? Two, you need three, another one. I need just one more. So let me show that card again. But I actually have, if I get two more of those, I could do card. these two. So Julie needs to get one more track built to get 40 points. Okay. I could do it. So hopefully I can stop you from doing that. Nah. Right. I'm first player. Okay, hang on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, take off our workers. Thank you. This is discarded. Slides down. Fog will be coming soon. This the rail the laying tracks is maxed out. Draw six. There's a lot of stone there. I know. Right. Um, okay, I'm so first. You're first. I'm thinking ahead here. You're converting. Mm -hmm. I'm taking the lay track option. Give me uh, two A again, please. You want to stay first, uh -huh. and I'm taking the excavation action. Okay. All right. Three. Iron ore. Yep. Me, I'm excavating. I get to excavate four plus my engine here. Plus my engine gives me plus two, so I get to excavate six. Still one left on that card. Now you get to convert. I'm doing it twice with the iron Put ore. In and I'm going to get two. You get two steel. Yep. Thank you. Now I get to, if I can, do two, and which you I can, can do. So I spend my two steel bars. I get ownership of these two. Nice. So now, now why am I doing that? I have one, two, three, four. Well, let's look at my cards. I need actually five to get these points. I'll have 39 points if I get a fifth one. So there are only two remaining. Julie can still get what she wants and I can get what I want. But it depends on what order it comes in, because the fog is coming up. 
All right, so let's remove the picture in picture. Uh, sun is coming. I'm mean, sorry, rain is coming. Uh, remove the guys. Oh, I gave you the wrong ones. You took, okay. you took my guys as prisoners. <laughs> Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. You know why this is bad? Because we're not going to get those. Okay, ready? This, um, this really screwed. sucks. Screwed. The current track rate is two. These are developed. You will not get that card. And neither will you. And I will only get one of my cards. I get two of mine at least. Yeah, so let's take a look at what happened there. Damn. So oh, sorry. Julie was hoping to get a fifth track yep. to get that 40 points. Luckily... She has these two, so she's still going to get, but you got to get more rubble. I am going to do that more rubble. next. But she can get these two and get the rubbles, and that's still over 40 points, but she was hoping to, to maximize. Yeah, exactly. Oh, well, and now, Darn. if you look at mine, I cannot get this card. Oh, oh no, I can't get this card. Oh, this okay. card is basically, I'm done. Oh, but I can get this one, this three. So that happens in the game. Yeah. So I'll show you. I can get this one because I've done four. But there's not a, the game basically developed these tracks so fast. Yeah. Darn it. That, uh, see, let me see when the game ends again. Is it when all the rubble is removed or all the tracks are developed? I don't know, honey. The last track is laid as a result of an event. Finish the current round. Oh, let me put myself on camera here. Finish the current round, then play one more round and proceed to scoring thereafter. So, because the game laid the last track, mm -hmm. we play this round and one more round. We know now the game's ending next round. Yep. And we know that the fog is coming up next round. All right, Julie, so knowing that. 1B, please. Okay. B, honey. Thank you, sweetie. 1B. Yeah. So you want rubble. Yes, I need the rubble. I need to build. And then so I'm gonna get I'll get that one and I'll get that one. Um you know what? Oh, this is just so stressful. Um I'm gonna do a building action. Okay. <clears throat> I'm taking a contract because okay. I, I have a lot of rubble I'm not going to be able to use. Oh, good. All right, so where are you excavating? Your excavation rate is four. One, One. So two, that was three, a good four. move. So and going second. first really helped you because you got how many points there? Uh, nine plus five at 14. Yeah, see, you might win now because you're able to excavate those two. And then your turn, honey, to. All right, so I have a bunch of steel bars mm -hmm. that I can't now lay rate tracks with, but I can use to build stations. So that's a seven. I'm looking around here. Seven for the best one. Seven to six. This was not, I can't build on this one yet because nope. there's still three rubble left there. So I'm going to convert one to this one. I'll have seven points for that. Yeah, and I forgot I was trying to go for that one, but I couldn't because the rubble is still there. Mm -hmm. So I'm still going to Spend build. I can only build once, so correct, honey? Yeah, only once. Okay, I'm going to go here because it's a seven. All right, so okay. you convert it, put yep. your ownership marker on there. Okay, now for me, I have some choices to make Wait, here. you took my things in here, I think. Yeah, you did. Okay. I had four. Yeah. You threw them all in there. Uh, That's actually, okay. It's three plus one, four. Yeah, my yep. mistake. That's okay. No worries. All right, so I'm looking at these cards here. <clears throat> I don't have any station cards, and I have built a lot on stations. So I'm going to take this one. Okay. Even though it allows me to build one more rail, even, <laughs> but I want it to get four victory, I mean, ten victory points, because out of all the cards I have here, I don't have any that gives me points for building on stations. Mm. So even though I, did. I haven't spent these yet, I'm not going to be able to use them anyway. So. Is that it, honey? That's it. Okay. 
Let me make sure. Yes, take our guys back. Oh, okay. Could you reach for mine again, please? Yes, I'd love to reach for yours, Julie. Thank you, sweetheart. I want to help you. I know, because you love Fog's me. Fog's coming up. Sun goes away. Fog. That means we can't excavate. That's correct. Okay. There's another fog disk in the game, but I'm just going to show it. That's the two that are there. We can excavate or build rail. Well, then. So it matters now who goes first, because this is the last round. And you want to ma maximize what you can do. Mm -hmm. By the way, you may want to wonder, what is this card sitting over here for? If all the rubble was excavated, you would have another build action you can take. But we still have this card way over here with rubble on it. But because the fog is out, we're not going to be able to excavate it anyway. None of these cards are going to help me anyway. Well, look at what you need. Can you build? you have steel? I do. So I am going to build. Yeah, you want to build. And so I'm just going to take... A build action? Yeah. I better take that last build action. What else is there to do? <sighs> you can try to take a contract card or move your surveyor. You know what? I'm going to move my surveyor so you can't do it. I'll just take another contract card just in case I have enough rubble. I mean, look, I could sit here and count it up and be all AP about it, but I'm not going to. Okay, I only have one bar. No analysis paralysis. Oh, I forgot these three. Oh, we didn't take the cubes. Hang on. Mm. This can change what we do. Okay, there is one event that we need to account for. And that is that this station is closed now. But okay. that's okay. All the other ones are open. Right. So. All right. I have my steel bar. And I just, I'm going to go here because it's worth seven. It's worth more than okay, the other yeah. ones. Oh, I apologize. I mean, taking this one here. You can't build on there yet. It's 3D oh, rubble. Oh, darn it, Jim. You can build on this one, this one, Okay. This one. I'll just do this one. Okay. Turn it over, sweetie. Oh, I apologize. Thank you. Yeah, it's no big deal. There you go. All right. So I have a choice here. I have steel bars. You do. I can build here for six. That's it. But instead, I'm going to switch out engines. Oh. So I'm going to use two steel bars. Okay. Actually, I only need one. Oh, nice. I'm going to use one steel bar to get this engine that's worth nine victory points. Oh, perfect. So I just... And you only needed one because there's uh, just a one in yeah, the corner? Yeah, there's only one. only takes one steel bar. So you can do Got that it. in the game. I'm switching it out. Okay. Julie didn't think of that. No, Julie didn't, but that's okay. Okay, and so, but you had that train last game that we played. I did. I still lost, but I, I had it. <laughs> okay, so for me, I'm looking at what cards I can get here. Okay. In case I have enough rubble. You have plenty Wait, over there, my I goodness. You know, I'm going to take this one. Do it. You have a lot over there. Yeah, I'm going to take this one. Good. And then... You move your surveyor up. Yep. So that's the end of the game. All right. All right. Oh, isn't there? Oh, here's a score pad, honey. Score pad with the pencil. with the Snowdonian uh, pencil that it came with. Yes, it was very nice. All right, so we have to go in order. Okay. Track ownership. So now we're going to go around the board and count where we own tracks. Okay. So I have two, five, what is that? A four, four. Nine, what is that? Three. Three. So I have 12. Do you want to put my name? D for Daw, David. <laughs> Remember I did that last time? Yes. <laughs> okay, Julie. Okay. All right, so we look at what Julie has. Two, five, seven, what is that, a five? Yep. Twelve. We're tied. We're tied. Now, it says not to remove the ownership markers yet because we need to decide how we're going to apply them to our contracts. So oh, you keep them okay. On the, you keep them on the cards for now. Okay. All right, so back to the next thing. Station ownership. So now we look at the tops of each station. Uh, I own this one. That's three points. Nice. This one, uh, well, wait, I got, I got to do mine. Three, six, eight, 13. That's 12. Eight plus 
Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. It is 13. 13. I apologize. That's all right. So I write it down. 13. Okay. Where do you own ones? Right over one. here. Nine and five. You sure? Yeah, nine right? and five. It's yeah. 14. Oh, you're beating me by one. <gasps> Julie's beating me by one. It right won't now. last long. It never lasts long. <laughs> it, comes to, it comes down to the contracts that you have. I know, and I don't so have this. This is what many. it is right now. So now we do our contracts. You're going to have to help me with that. So this that. is going to take a little bit of effort. So I'm going to do mine first. Yes. So I have all these choices to pick from. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I want to try to maximize. And this is where we can get kind of. Analysis paralysis. <laughs> you know that was a word. <laughs> I just made it up. Oh, good. <laughs> All right. So I now what I'm going to do now. This is where you take your ownership markers off. So I'm going to take my ownership markers off for my trains okay. first. I have four. Correct. Okay. Mhm. Mm so I look under here. I have a one and a three. Mhm. Mm I'm going to do that one. Okay. Okay. Mhm. Mm so that's for sure I'm getting 24. Nice. This one I'm not doing. But now i got to sign the rubble. Oh. This is where I can get kind of, because I didn't, I didn't convert much in the stone. No, you didn't. If I want to get to 17 points here, I need eight rubble here for sure. Oh, you got it. Four. Eight. Nice. Okay, for sure that's scoring. Absolutely. Oh, I think I can get them all. Oh, honey, that's great. And again, some people will sit there and count ahead. We didn't do that. I have a hard enough time just getting figured out what I need to do. Okay, so I got th that contract as well. Way to go. Eight rubble, eight rubble, eight rubble, and I had some even left over. Now I look at my yeah. stations. One, two, three, four. I had four stations. Mm -hmm. actually, oh, wait, you had some I even had too, more. Honey. I actually had... You had six. I actually had these two here. Correct. That's it. That's it. So I could even got another station card. So I was able. I got really fortunate there. You did wonderful. I had five contracts. So now under, I'm going to do it off screen here for a second. So I have uh, eleven. Well, I'm going to have to add them up. Yeah. So that's going to be twenty-two for those. And the other ones I can do individually: twenty-four, seventeen. And ten. So that's great, sweetie. I combine two. Oh. To Twenty-two. Twenty-four, seventeen, and ten. Now I can sum it up well. here, but I'm not going to right now. Oh, okay. So let's look at your your area. <sighs> okay. First off, this is not even gonna be needed. Okay. Do you have any that takes rubble? Uh yes, this one. That's why I have it. Alright, so put it on. One, two, three, four, five, right, six. Well you're off camera. Oh. I'm s it's hard to do all this at once. Okay, but fix it up, please, so it's on camera. I'm going to get your... Uh, I have six. Your rail ownership markers. Okay, there's my six rubble. You need one. And you're I need three there. Three? Yes. Okay, so you got that. It's too bad I didn't have two more. I could have done that one, too. Okay, so this one, you can't, you can't do this one. And I can't or do this, this one. That one for sure. Now, this is... 24 versus 17. So this is the better one to do. Yes. We'll flip that so one tell over. me, what are the two contracts worth? One's worth 18. Okay. The other one is worth 24. There's no eraser on this. Oh, gosh, you got to You've got to be really careful. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> All right. It's so. good thing I'm not doing the adding. <laughs> Oops. So I've, we've added that. Mm -hmm. Let's ways. look at the next thing. Okay. Which is trains. That's only you. I have the train that's worth nine. Yes, nice. Should I write that down? Let me move this stuff out of the way. Okay. Destroying the board. <laughs> okay, that's nine. Surveyors. Your sur surveyor. Yes. Is it four? Is further is at the four mark. Where's your son? Oh, you're only at the one. Yeah, I'm at the one. Oh, that's all right. Okay, so now I'm going to add it all up. Okay. So. So he'll do that off camera because. I couldn't do it on camera, and I don't expect him to as well. Okay, 6, 14, 18, 22, 3, 4, 5, 7, 5, 7, 11, 18, 28, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 10. All right, so 
it came down to getting those contracts. I had 108 nice. Julia 72, but see look how much more I had in contracts. Oh, I know. You did a wonderful job on that. It's too bad that, because you were doing a good job at stations. I was. You had uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mm -hmm. stations. So if you would have gotten some contracts with stations, it would have done really you well. You didn't even use those. I know. So let's, I mean, for instance, if well, you, I did have my station card, but you said it was it's but you needed not rails. as good. I needed rails. So for, uh, for instance, just take a look at the deck here real quick. That one's not that good. It's only one no. six. We probably lost. Like this one right here, but it was early on in the game. Right. She would have had this one been 15 points. She had 15 stations. Yeah. I mean, five stations. Five stations. All right. So. It's all right. Oops. It's no big deal. It was fun. So that's Nodonia, a worker placement game with, uh, I mean, really quick rounds. And yeah. you do have to think ahead. And that's kind of hard. Well, harder for some. Yep. All right. So thank you for watching RP Game Pyre. I'm thank David. Thank you. I'm Julie. Oh, I forgot to mention. That if we get 100 likes, we have a, a ton of scenarios. Yes. I mean, there's a lot of game in this master set. The box is so heavy. But I mean, if you just oh look at gosh. here, it has <laughs> special scoring for the scenarios. And wow. then if you look at the, the cheat sheet. There you go. Well, actually, this is the cheat sheet I wanted to show. Oh. <laughs> All these little icons here is considerations right here. For depending on what scenario you're playing, there's decks of cards for those. Oh my goodness. You see all that right there? Yeah. Depending on what scenario you're playing, it's telling you what you have to account for. Oh my gosh. So. That's a lot. There's a lot of game. But anyways, thanks for watching. Please Thank you. subscribe and like. Thank you so much. Right. See bye you next bye. time. Bye-bye.